Good morning students welcome back to the biology class students we are discussing the chapter 5 kingdom classification in the previous session we learned about classification advantages of classification and hierarchy of classification today we will be discussing about classification system Robert Whittaker in 1959 introduced the five kingdom classification system According to this the whole living world is divided into five kingdoms These are kingdom Monera kingdom Protista kingdom Plantae kingdom Fungi and kingdom Animalia We will study each kingdom in detail Today we will start with kingdom monera kingdom monera consist of unicellular organisms these organisms have no well defined nucleus and many of the cell organelles are also absent they may or may not have a cell wall their mode of nutrition is either autotrophic or heterotrophic that is they can make their own food or they depend on others for their nutrition they are mostly present as a single cell but sometimes they live in groups called colonies bacteria and blue green algae are examples of kingdom monera bacteria can be found in different shapes such as cocci which is spherical shape bacilli rod shape spirilla spiral shape and vibrio comma shape some bacteria are useful while others are harmful so first let us discuss the economic importance of bacteria Bacteria help in maintaining the ecological system. Some bacteria act as nature's scavengers as they help in decomposing dead plants and animals. They have a major role in nitrogen fixation. They also increase the soil fertility. Some bacteria help in tanning of leather. while some help in vitamin synthesis bacteria also plays a role in industry for the production of various items like vinegar insecticides solvents etc bacteria has a role in medicine also they help in production of certain antibiotics and drugs Some harmful aspects of bacteria are they can cause infectious diseases they are responsible for the decay of foods they can cause food poisoning So in today's lesson we discuss the classification system in which we get to know that the whole living world is divided into 5 kingdoms out of which we discussed kingdom monera today in kingdom monera we discussed the general characteristics of kingdom monera different shapes of bacteria economical importance of bacteria and harmful aspects of bacteria i hope you understood and enjoyed today's session i'll be sending you a worksheet along this lesson till then Stay safe we will be back with another interesting topic soon thank you